This year's winners are Corey Matthews and Sean Hunter. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> Mr. Feeney, this is so unfair. They just keep turning in the same cans year after year. Hey, Sean, A plus. I'm better than you are now. Why are all those guys talking to Sean's girlfriend? Well, Sean and Jennifer broke up this morning. Look at her, she's already on the prowl. Well, how's Sean taking it? Are you kidding? Sean is Sean. You can't keep Sean down. Get up, Sean. <laughs> Look what they've done to my boy. Oh, Sean, if it's any consolation, I think you can do a lot better than Jennifer Bassett. I think so. Uh, wait a minute, Topanga. Have you looked at her? Okay, so she's pretty, she's tall, she drives a new red convertible. Oh, heck, I'd go out with her. He's your best friend. How could I ever come between you and your best friend? <laughs> <laughs> did, did, did you see that? Yeah, I saw that. Well, what do you think it means? Nothing good for you. <laughs> Get up, Corey. He dumped me. He dumped me good. And I thought, oh, maybe this is good news. Oh, hi, Sean. Oh, Topanga, do you know... Hi. <laughs> Look, I just came from the classic section. You know, classics. Old favorites. There's something there you might be interested in. Oh, okay, thank you, Topanga. Just gonna go check out that book then. Mm, company, huh? It's adorable, he's been at it all afternoon. Honey, do you need some help? Mom, I said dinner was at 6.30 sharp. Here it is, 7.02, and nowhere to be seen. There she is, everything's okay. Topanga, you have no idea how much he loves you. We'll just get out of your way. Sorry I'm late, Corey, but the pie took forever and I wanted it to be perfect for your big dinner tonight. Thanks, but I'm afraid we've both wasted our time. He'll show up. Yeah, he'll show up. In the meantime, I'll just stick my beef brochettes back in the oven until they're ruined. <laughs> oh, Corey, I've got to go to dinner with my parents and you have got to lighten up, mister. Aren't you going to answer that? Oh, let him worry for a change. <laughs> Oh, who am I kidding? He doesn't even like tennis. Corey, look at yourself. You're a wreck. Don't you see, Topanga? Sean doesn't need me anymore. He's got Jennifer now. Look, Corey, when you and I first started going out, I never kept you from seeing Sean. Because I understand that there's something about a best friend that no one can replace. You understood that? Of course. Why would I spend the entire day baking a pie that I know I'm never going to eat? Because you're a sweet girl. And Sean deserves a sweet girl, too. A girl who understands that a best friend is part of who you are. And if she doesn't accept your best friend, then she's really not accepting you. Yeah. So what do you think I should do? I think you should forget about dinner here, clean up the kitchen, and in about an hour, go have dinner at Chubby's. Why? In about an hour. Did you see me? No. Actually, there's somebody else who wanted to see you. Well, I know you two don't get to see each other very often anymore, so I'll just wait outside. Some girlfriend. I've always thought so. How did you know I was here? I got an anonymous tip on my cell phone. But from who? I mean, the only one who knew we were here was <gasps> Topanga. Yes, it was I who made the call. But why? It's time she knew. That's right, Jennifer. Corey and Sean have kept their relationship alive despite your evil attempt to keep them apart. Because it's time I realize I'm getting more than I'm losing. Well, I hope you all be very happy together. Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> <laughs> well, gang, the good thing is things are finally back to normal. No more secrets, no more lies, no more sneaking around. See you at school? Yeah. Yeah, okay, I'll see you at school. Okay. Ha, ha, ha.